Welcome to this new how-to. In this how-to, we're gonna look at an option which might be was a already familiar to you, but it has to do with loading flights uh, which are created in the world map or created by Simbri, for example, and then uh, which you want to load in the world map. Uh, for those who are, I would say, playing, for example, both on the uh, PC and on the Xbox, this might be a very valuable option because you have the option to say load from xbox cloud storage or load from this pc right so if you're opening from this pc then it well as you might already guess it was just open the file right i can just open the uh, the flight plan which i had and then it will show it normally as expected right so if i now say okay save to xbox cloud storage uh, i need to provide a name that's i would say i'm not sure if it's oh, i should call it a bug but it's kind of weird that they simply don't take the name which uh you or from the same file right so i'm gonna say okay eff to efro and i'm gonna say it's uh, a flight plan right so it's not a flight and now it has saved it so what happens now if i would go to the uh, normal option and reset right and do the same thing I can say load from uh, Xbox storage and there I can also select it. The nice thing is that you can uh, either do it on the same PC or you can share it with the Xbox, right? And load it on the Xbox, which makes sure that you're always having the same flight plan no matter from which uh, device you're playing with. Uh, the other advantage is that you can uh, say save all those flight plans which are really interesting on your Xbox storage. So if you, for some reason, there's something wrong with your PC, you can simply uh, scratch it, reinstall it, and then uh, directly load the flight plans or the flights because you saw that it was also an option by using the uh, load from Xbox cloud storage option. Uh, the thing I didn't figure out yet is, okay, hey, that's all nice, right? We've got now this flight plan, but how can you get rid of it? Uh, that's something which is probably either not in the interface or maybe it's not even possible, but that's something I'm investigating. And as soon as I found out how to do that, I will of course let you know. So in this video we looked at how you can share flight plans and flights between I would say your PC and your Xbox or use the uh, cloud storage as a backup solution for your flights and flight plans. I do think that has been introduced in one of the world updates or one of the sim updates. Uh, I saw someone also using this option. So I not 100% sure, but I don't think it will be added as part of sim update number 8. But that's, I would say, I'm, again, I'm not 100% sure. I think it has been added earlier. Again, if this option is available already, you can start already using it. Else you need to wait for uh, sim update number 8, which will be released uh, soonish, right? Somewhere in March. So then you, then you can also use the same option as I just uh, have demoed you in this movie. Here ends this video. I hope you liked it. If you liked it, then consider to use the like button. If you've got questions or comments, then feel free to post them in the comment box below. And if you want to stay up to date about new videos I'm posting, then make sure that you're subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.